Okay guys, today I'm going to, I am testing out, see if I can get Windows 10 to install on the 10 year old laptop. It's an old Inspiron 9300. As you can see, we got the better screen in it. Yeah, about that. Um, there is a recall, and about a week after the warranty expired, we got a line. That was seven years ago, so yeah, it's pretty bad, but... You can still see what's behind it, like these white stripes, you can't really tell right now, but they are not opaque, it's just lighter there, it does work, yeah. But we're going to see if you can install and have it run right, and see how well it does, Windows 10 on an old Inspiron. Oh. So far so good, we got the little spinning circles inside the colored lines, yeah. I'll report back once we, oh, well, never mind, let's see what this is. Okay, so far so good. Stall. I'm gonna try this earlier on our old computer. Not that one. I just installed that one too, but it works okay there. Um, but yeah, the other computer had an IDE hard drive, and it just wouldn't find it at all, and it wouldn't take any of the drivers I had either for like XP or Vista. So yeah. And this computer does have an IDE hard drive, but we'll see how it does. <clears throat> well, it found the hard drive, that's good. So, just delete these because there's nothing important on this computer anyways. This is just kind of my test laptop now. Yeah, this thing, it's tried to die on me before, but I put the motherboard in the oven, and now it's back. So it's been struck by lightning a few times, and it still somehow works. I mean, it all works just fine, with the exception of the screen. Yeah. So far, so good. I'll report back once the installation is done. We'll test it out. Okay, so, okay, so the Windows 10 does work. For the most part, the only exception, oh, for the login here, is the Wi Fi. So, right now, I have to have it plugged in with a network cable, and that other wire is just that's just for my microphone, which doesn't seem to be the Cortana thing, doesn't seem to work too much either. It just sits there and thinks for an eternity. Um, but for the most part, it does work. Yep, there you go. Got my background, and like down here. I, oh, where'd it go? I do have the wireless driver installed, but just no network show up. Which I don't quite understand. Yeah, you click there. Yeah, it's still in everything. Come on. Yeah, see, it just says network 3, which is the wired one. It doesn't show any of the wireless networks. We have three of them here, and none of them show up. But, other than that, though, it does work. I mean, the portal thing, that's just for my hacked video drivers. It puts it on there. I don't know why. There we go. But, yeah, with the Cortana. What's my name? It still just says listening. Focus. Yeah, it just says listening there, and that's it. Yeah. Really didn't want to do much else, but it does, in fact, work. I mean, as you can see here. I mean, as far as opening things up, it does seem fairly responsive. <laughs> Watch it not be responsive. Come on. Oh, there's no bar. But yeah, it does work. <laughs> I 
Yeah. So you can run Windows 10 on an old on old hardware. And here I'll pull up the specs real quick so you guys can see it. It's a Pentium M, like 1.73 gigahertz, I believe. Uh, with 2 gigs of RAM. Okay, so... Focus. We can kind of see this Pentium M processor. 1.73 gigahertz. 2 gigs of RAM. Don't want anyone to focus. We have 32 bit. And yeah. And this is build um, like 10130, I believe. Don't think it says right here. But yeah, that's what it is. So there you can kind of see the specs a little bit, but yep. Old Inspiron 9300 from 2005. It will focus now. There we go. You see a Pentium M processor, 1.73 gigahertz, 2 gigs of RAM, 32-bit operating system, x86 base processor. And yeah. Windows 10. Prove that right there. But yeah. I might be doing more videos later on about the oh come on focus. About the performance and stuff of it on normal hardware, like Core 2 Duo and then maybe um my gaming rig up there, which is a um, AMD FX 8350, 8 core, 4 gigahertz. Pretty sweet. Yeah, but thanks for watching. Until next time, have a good one.